but he says, all right, here's a question. Other than Scully's hair, your hair looks gorgeous, by the way. Thank you. Uh, how, has, how has Scully evolved since audiences last seen her? Well, um, she's older than I am and, um, and shows it. And um, now she's, um, how has she evolved? Um, you know, it's more in the mood of the piece, as you'll see wh when you see the film, the, the, um, the time that's passed between uh, then and now in these six years, you, you really feel it as, as a, it's almost like another entity of the film, another character. And there's something kind of, um, I don't know how to explain it. There's something kind of beautiful about that. You really get the history between these two people and, and, um, and, uh, and what's gone in between. And I think that's kind of the only evolution she's doing, uh, you know, she's doing what she always wanted to do um, in the film, and she's very serious about it, and she's very passionate, and otherwise she's just kind of the same old Scully, sort of, older. Somebody, somebody out there says they love your long hair. Uh, here's a question that somebody uh, sent in, probably never heard before. What is it like coming together and working with David after all these years? Oh, I've never heard that before. First time. You know, I think that... Um, but by the end of the series, we were t we were exhausted, you know, and and uh, n neither of us were were quiet about our, our desire to, to exit at the, at the right time for some people and not the right time for others. But it was, um, you know, the the, I the idea of us being able to come back together again at any point in the future was something that we were always excited about and willing to do. And and the fact that it actually happened as opposed to fall apart that many times it felt like it was going to fall apart was um, was. Was it was very exciting. Okay, hug a tree on the internet wants to know. Hug a tree for me. Sorry, don't want to offend a fan out there. Um, wants to know how are you like or unlike Scully? I'm trying to figure out what that has to do with hugging a tree, but I guess it doesn't. I don't know. Some environmentalist ex files man. Okay, that's cool. How am I? Uh, um I don't know, you know, it's so hard to know when you spend so much time with a character how much of you you bring to the character and how much of the character you have inside of you afterwards. Like, I don't know um, how many of my character traits I would not have today had I not played Scully. Would I be as um, questioning, as, 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 uh, as independent, as forthright, as fearless? I don't know. Or, or, or is it that, that I already had those attributes and it, it helped me to, to imbue them into her? I, I really, I can't answer that question. Here's a question. I understand you did not have total access to the script all the time. It's like you were supposed to give it back and you only got that day's script. How hard was it for you to prepare? We had, um, we had a version of the script um, ourselves that, that only had the scenes that we were working on. And then, um, and then the sides every day that we got the small, the individual scenes we had to give back. So, but we didn't have the stuff. You know, I constantly had to ask, well, what happens before that? You know, who? Did somebody die right before this? Should I? Yeah, you, know, you know. Oh, okay. So it must have been a challenge. It was. Yeah. But worth it. But worth it, obviously. By the way, uh, congratulations about uh, the Gellhorn picture oh, that you're you. going to be doing. By the way, have you picked? Uh, have you picked a Hemingway? Uh, I have in my mind. Um, doesn't mean that <laughs> that he'll agree to do it, but it's it's a very high reach, and um, I'm not going to talk about it any more than that. All right. Well, but by the way, we just have to just talk about the X Files movie itself. Uh, and I think is that our, our last question? I think oh, we have we have one we have one more question for you. What have you missed about the X Files series? Um, what have I missed about the series? That's interesting. Um, I don't know. I mean, t I mean, to a certain degree, there, there was something that was always enjoyable about knowing, obviously, that you have a, a job um, every day, but also, you know, um, there there were aspects of it that that were huge fun. And um, I don't know. It's it's hard because as much as I appreciate my involvement in it over time, I'm glad that it's something in the past, and I can't imagine doing it again today. You know, with soon to be three kids and and oh, Mazel tov. And old and creaky as I am. Gorgeous as ever. All right, uh, we've got to wrap it up right now. Uh, thank you so much, Jillian Anderson. We really appreciate it. Enjoy the movie. Thanks so much. Thank you very much. Hope you enjoy it. All right, everybody.